Electronics are hard, rigid, and brittle. But what if electronics were soft, flexible, and curvy like the human body? Imagine electronics that could bend, stretch, and fit on your body like a Band-Aid or a child's tattoo. Imagine the implications. Today's our electronics are stiffer by up to six orders of magnitude compared to soft tissue in the human body. Now, six orders of magnitude. To appreciate this difference, consider an example of comparable magnitude difference in terms of a small insect compared to the tallest peaks of one of my favorite mountains, K2, five kilometers in size. That's what six orders of magnitude difference looks like. We can now bridge this sort of gap that exists between rigid electronics and soft biological systems by exploiting a few simple and elegant microfabrication techniques uh, and tricks. Much like a rigid piece of wood that can be thinned and oriented down to a soft, flexible sheet of tissue paper, we can take a rigid block of silicon, it's in wafer form, thin it down into flexible silicon ribbons and then reorient and repurpose them to make stretchable, um, stretchable electronics given micro spring-like structures in between them. And what we achieve are tissue-like electronics that can be laminated on the skin as in a Band-Aid, uh, which are invisible to the user and mechanically isolated. We can also achieve tissue-like sensors that can be laminated on internal organs like the heart uh, to gain insight into problems like atrial fibrillation. And finally, we could build systems that are minimally invasive, like a balloon catheter that can be deflated and inflated inside the heart to track arrhythmias, as well as delivering therapy and diagnostics, all on a single device, given the stretchable electronics. Finally, soft biointegrated electronics have implications over a broad range of different applications, including consumer and biomedical devices. These devices that we've shown here uh, have the potential to fundamentally change the way and bridge the gap between electronics and biology and these, the way these systems interchange and interact. My name is Ruzbe Ghaffari. I'm co-founder at MC10. Thank you.